This is the Bell Cycle, my entry for the Hackaday 2017 finalist prize. It's like nothing you've ever seen before. It's a new kind of low cost bicycle. It's novel and quirky and really fun to ride. You get to sit comfortably upright with your hands by your side. It takes about 20 minutes to learn to ride and people on the street love it. Hello, my name is Alex. I've been tinkering with and riding the Bell Cycle around New York City for a few years now. I originally built it because I like new and interesting things. On the Bell Cycle, your weight is positioned in the center of the bike. You pedal the front wheel instead of the back wheel like on a traditional bicycle. It has a new, unique gear arrangement. How a Bell Cycle gets made is also new. The frame is made of water jet cut aluminum pieces that are connected with tubes. Instead of just buying a bike, you build one from a kit. It's a great way of understanding and experimenting with engineering, invention, and design. The Bell Cycle is modular. You can make it an easy to ride tricycle. You can make a cargo bike. Or you can build a wooden bike. My hope is that the Bell Cycle is a starting point for your creativity. It's a chance for you to be an engineer and do some real world problem solver. New transportation solutions are key to improving overcrowded cities and global warming. Most of the bicycle industry is focused on sporting goods, not urban solutions. Here in New York and around the world, we need more bicycles, but with some variety. We need smaller bicycles, less expensive bicycles, electric bicycles, cargo bicycles, bicycles that easily fit on public transportation. The Bell Cycle is the beginning of a modular, open source system of bicycle engineering. Trek is not going to build the delivery bicycle which replaces the delivery truck, but we can. And by building a variety of bicycles to solve urban transportation woes, we can help reduce fossil fuel emissions and ease city congestion. The Bell Cycle system starts with this bike because it highlights what can happen when you think outside the box. It's small, it's inexpensive, and it gets people to see things differently. 